Marine reptiles are reptiles which have become secondarily adapted for an aquatic or semi-aquatic life in a marine environment. The earliest marine reptiles arose in the Permian period during the Paleozoic era. During the Mesozoic era, many groups of reptiles became adapted to life in the seas, including such familiar clades as the ichthyosaurs, plesiosaurs. These two orders were once thought united in the group Phenoliosauria, a classification now cladistically obsolete, mosasaurs, nothosaurs, placodonts, sea turtles, thalatosaurs, and thalatosuchians. After the mass extinction at the end of the Cretaceous period, marine reptiles were less numerous, but there was still a high variety of species in the early Cenozoic, such as true sea turtles, bothremidids, paleophyte snakes, a few charistodares such as cimidosaurus and dirosaurid crocodilomorphs. Various types of marine gavialid crocodilians remained widespread as recently as the late Miocene. Currently, of the approximately 12,000 extant reptile species and subspecies, only about 100 of are classed as marine reptiles. Extant marine reptiles include marine iguanas, sea snakes, sea turtles, and saltwater crocodiles. Some marine reptiles, such as ichthyosaurs, plesiosaurs, metriorinchid thalatosuchians, and mosasaurs, became so well adapted to a marine lifestyle that they were incapable of venturing onto land and gave birth in the water. Others, such as sea turtles and saltwater crocodiles, return to shore to lay their eggs. Some marine reptiles also occasionally rest and bask on land. Extant varieties Sea turtles, there are seven extant species of sea turtles, which live mostly along the tropical coastlines of Central and South American and the Caribbean, though some do migrate long distances and have been known to travel as far north as Scandinavia. Sea turtles are largely solitary animals, though some do form large, though often loosely connected groups during nesting season. Although only seven turtle species are truly marine, many more dwell in brackish waters. Sea snakes, the most abundant of the marine reptiles, there are over 60 different species of sea snakes. They inhabit the tropical and subtropical waters of the Indian and Pacific Oceans, though very limited reports of sightings suggest they may be extending into the Atlantic Ocean. Sea snakes are venomous and their bites have been known to be fatal, though generally they only bite when provoked and often inject only a very small, non-fatal quantity of venom. Sea snakes are distinguished from terrestrial snakes by a vertically flattened tail. Marine iguana. Marine iguanas live only on the Galapagos Islands and are not fully adapted to marine life. Although they feed exclusively on marine plants and spend a good deal of their time in the water, they do nest on land and need to bask in the sun to reach their ideal body temperature. They are thus also subject to terrestrial predators. Saltwater and American crocodiles, none of the 23 extant species of crocodiles is truly marine, however, the saltwater crocodile Crocodilus porosus, does display adaptations to saltwater inhabitation and dwells in the brackish waters of Southeast Asia and Australia. Saltwater crocodiles dispose of excess salt in their bodies through specialized salt glands. These animals are the largest species of crocodiles, also making them the largest of the reptiles, they can grow up to 6 meters in length. American crocodiles Crocodilus acutus, similarly prefer brackish over freshwater habitats. Conservation Most species of marine reptiles are considered endangered to some degree. All but one species of sea turtles are endangered due to destruction of nesting habitats on coastal lands, exploitation, and marine fishing. Many species of sea snakes are threatened or endangered due to commercial exploitation, sale of skins, and pollution, especially in Asia. Marine iguanas are threatened due to their very limited habitation range. Saltwater crocodiles are at low risk for extinction. See also List of marine reptiles List of semi-aquatic tetrapods Salt gland References